This is an excerpt of a recent power-up webinar looking at the new audio repair features in Adobe Audition Creative Cloud. In this excerpt, I'll show you how to remove hum, both AC hum from power and mic cables getting tangled together, and hum that came into a telephone conversation. This is a hum problem. And I'll pull this gain up a bit using the HUD spacebar. Paul, we're standing behind the clearly hum right here. Not only do I have hum, but I've also got crowd noise. Listen again. And look at where that is. It's just negative 12 dB of nothing but bad noise. Well, we could remove hum in a variety of ways. We could try to do a parametric equalizer, but there's a very, very powerful tool. I'll go back to the effects rack, click the right pointing arrow, and go to noise reduction and add the D hummer. Anything that comes from the effects rack can be applied to both multi-track clips and waveform clips. I'm using waveforms because it makes it easier to isolate a single clip, but I could easily apply this as a filter to all the clips on a track that have hum. When I hit the home key and press the space bar, Paul, we're standing behind the scenes of the Apple. The, the hum is gone. I mean, it's, it's not there. It's just, it's missing like it was, wow. Paul, we're standing. Except it's totally destroyed my voice. Well, listen to what my voice sounds like with the filter off. Paul, we're standing behind the scenes. So I've got a richness and a timber in my voice that's gone. Paul, we're standing behind the When I put the filter in. So here's your task. Your goal is to use the fewest number of harmonics that still makes the hum disappear while improving the character of the voice. Paul, we're standing behind the scenes of the app. Better. Paul, we're standing behind the Still better. Paul, we're standing behind the scenes. That's the best. So this is what it sounds like without the filter. Paul, we're standing behind the And this is what it sounds like with the filter. Paul, we're standing behind the scenes of the The hum is gone. Now, when we're adjusting the hummer for power line, we're either going to dial in 60 hertz for North America, or we're going to dial in 50 hertz for the rest of the world. And what this does is it makes sure to notch out exactly those frequencies that are caused by microphone cables running too close to power cables. But what happens if we have a different kind of hum? And that's what I ran into just a couple weeks ago. I did an audio recording, and there was a serious hum on the phone line. So my mic was clean. The update to Smoke 2013, I thought, it, but her mic was really noisy because it came in over the phone line. Flame Academy. The Smoke Flame Academy is a group of people which are... And you probably can't hear that in the live show, but you can hear it on the recorded show, so I isolated this. If we look at this on the meters and scale the meters back to 60 dB, we're going to see that there's about 48 dB of hum. So I want to use the dehummer to get rid of that. Select our track, click on the right pointing arrow, noise reduction dehummer, but look at what happens when I hit the spacebar to play this. Look at that. There's the hum right there. It's at a wholly different level. There we go. So what I did is I simply click, hold, and drag the frequency of the base hum removal. So I park it on top of that spike because the chart shows me exactly where it needs to be. And because I want a notch filter, I'm going to turn off all the harmonics except one. And now when I play this back, That filter has totally taken out the telephone hum. I can change this to any frequency I want. I noticed for a while that I was getting a hum around 179 cycles. So I just put a single dehummer, a notch filter, on that frequency and cleaned it right up. Because this is only on the clip that has the phone interview on it, it doesn't change the quality of my voice at all. I did not apply it to the master. I applied it to, to her clip. But I was really impressed at how adding the dehummer filter took out that phone line interference 
almost instantly. It showed me exactly where I needed to place it based upon the spikes in the audio, and then I just decreased all the harmonics to one, and her voice stayed the same, and the hum was gone. If you need to stretch your training dollars, a subscription membership to our video training library saves you money. You can access all of our videos for a low monthly price of only $19.99. That's more than 500 movies, dozens of hours of training, all in-depth and up-to-date. Plus, members can attend any of our Power Up webinars for free. Our training covers Apple and Adobe software. We update it every week, and for more information, visit LarryJordan.biz slash subscriptions. This has been an excerpt of a recent Power Up webinar on the new audio repair features inside Adobe Audition Creative Cloud. For the complete version of this online training, please visit our store at LarryJordan.biz slash store and look for webinar 100.